David P, step number one. Okay, question. David, is this in factored form? Class, is this in factored form? Yes. yes. Class, how do you know this is in factored form? It has parentheses. Ivan A, what's next? Let's get a basic graph. <coughs> this is going to become what class? X squared. This one's going to become just x to the first power. So if it helps you, go ahead and write the multiplicity or the exponent of 1. Class, what's x squared times x? x to the third power. This is an odd, so what does it look like? What's the easiest odd you know? X to the first. It's just a line, right? So we're going to start down and up. The class, what does that negative sign do? We're not going to start down. We're going to start up and then end down. Okay? So the negative sign will just switch the arrows. <coughs> Crystal, what's the next thing? <coughs> We're going to do the multiplicity. It's just this chart that helps us organize it. Class, x is equal to what value here? Positive or negative 1? Positive 1. If you're not sure why that's a positive 1, you should be using the zero product rule. Add 1. x equals 1. So here is my 0. Or zeros. This is our degree, and this is our shoot through or kiss. Saul, so here at x equals 1, what's the degree here? Two. 2 is correct. Is 2 an odd or an even? It is an even number. Are you going to shoot through or kiss? kiss. You are going to kiss. Elvis, <coughs> x is equal to negative 4. Elvis, what's our degree? Shoot through or kiss? Shoot through because this is a odd. Alright, there are no transformations because there is nothing behind it. The other transformation that we did is we just uh, flipped our end behaviors. Let's go ahead and graph it. Pick your favorite color. Negative 4. Now you could also add some more details such as the y intercept by making your x value 0. Alright, pay attention. Look at my arrows. Starts up. Ends where? Down. Everyone say pencil. Do our, use our pencil. Brooklyn, from this starting point, which direction do we go? Left to right or right to left? We're going to go left to right. Brooklyn, as I approach the yellow, what's going to happen there? We're going to shoot through. And then our next color is purple. Gustavo, what are we going to do there? <coughs> so we're going to kiss or bounce off. So in order to go to this purple, I'm going to have to make a turning point, which we learned yesterday, right? 
you're switching from either decreasing to increasing in this case. And there we need to bounce. Everyone say smooth curves. It better not be a V. And then we have to end up at that arrow. And if you make mistakes like I am, you could just make your lines a little bit thicker. Hence, don't use pen. And here's our graph by hand.